kit consists of for the AKM, AK47, AK74 series flash generator, mini muzzle flash generator, three parts power supply, an electronics unit, also doubles as a high power torch, standard mounting for any size barrel, slotted adapter. 14mm negative to 24mm positive. Lighting unit. It comes with that's the kit, three pieces. Now to show you the installation. Okay, step one, remove the flash suppressor. Remember this little spring retaining us. You need to depress the spring. This is a knife. And screw it off. Be careful not to lose the spring in the retaining pin, as I've done so many times. Remove the spring, retaining pin. kit we need the slotted adapter you'll see that when it's screwed in completely the slot is on the downside directly centered downside install the retaining spring Second part of the kit is the lighting unit. Absolutely pop it in. Boom. Falls in naturally. No obstructions, nothing. Simple drop in. Remember to keep the two wires to the downside. Because that's where the, the slot is. The wires need to sit inside the slot. I find the best way to do this is to simply take the unit. You'll notice that the pin has got a slight chamfer on one side, chamfer out into the slot, like such, into the flash suppressor, and turn it on. All the way in. When it hits the spring, you need to hold the spring back. Turn this around to see. Spring returned and the square in. All the way. In. all that sticks out. Now, part two. You need to mount the lighting unit to the barrel. The lighting unit simply comes with these screws. on the bottom. Slip in the 
see it's a very nice fit. It's a super, super snug fit. Very little play. Pass the play. Screw it on. has to be removed for this. Otherwise it just will not fit. There's no space for it. Well maybe not, let's see. Let's get this installed and let's have a look at that actually take the barrel cleaning rod. I doubt it but we'll see. and straight under the barrel. screws the power supply is installed threading that through the loop of the uh, muzzle uh, barrel cleaner you can thread that if you don't want to do that you can probably get away with running it around backward which just about And there it is installed. Very unobtrusive. This wire can be pushed back into the tube, make it less wrappy and roundy. Very unobtrusive. Hardly notice it. You'll notice that the light is on permanently here. I have a bypass switch installed. As this is prototyping. Test of proof of concept. The flashlight works independently. One off switch on the flashlight does not affect the light coming from the flash uh, generator. Now, I know some of you are using extended inner barrels. And you're saying, oh, I can't use my extended inner barrel, it's going to affect the workings of the, the light sensing unit. Or This does not use the regular uh, motion detector proximity sensor that 99% of muzzle flash generators use. This uses a completely new system. I won't get into much detail in, you know, on that, but let's just say that you can have a barrel extension right up to the end if you wish. You can have it as far out as you want. It won't affect the performance of the flash. 
the flesh said does not sense what's passing through here the flesh actually comes from the inside okay it comes from here but the signal to send the flesh here comes from a separate unit which is connected to this via Bluetooth so if no, if a shot is fired and there's no BB the sensing actually happens down there way at the beginning of the barrel so if a shot is fired and there's no BB no signal will be sent to, to this and the light, the light will not flash this gives you a much better performance much more accurate and is way stable what's also nice about this battery replacement is a breeze I'll screw the back section You have it. Battery housing with uh, three AAA batteries. These are batteries feed the entire system electronics and the torch, all in one. You can use rechargeable batteries inside here, but there's no port for recharging the batteries on board. I may, on a later prototype stage, add a port to the bottom. Small little, little tiny mini jack for charging rechargeable batteries. Uh, so you don't need to open this. If I do install the port, you don't need to open this whatsoever. And that's about it. That's the AK series. Thanks for watching.